Hey guys, Donnie Wright side here. Bookmakers review. We finally made it. The last week of preseason football before we get to see opening night on September 5th, which is a Thursday, where the Kansas City Chiefs are going to take on the Baltimore Ravens. But we got some business to get after. I got a doubleheader that we're going to take a look at here on Saturday, which I do think has some value. Now, granted, we're going to be laying points in both of these games, but I do think it makes some sense. Let's get to it. This Saturday's action, game number one, 121-122 on the rotation. That's a 1 o'clock kickoff on Saturday afternoon. That's going to be between the Pittsburgh Steelers and the Detroit Lions. If we look at the Lions here opening as a minus three-point favor to the road team, that's the Pittsburgh Steelers. Home team here, Detroit Lions, getting three points. The one thing that we do know is I'm not expecting to see Jared Goff or really any starters here for Detroit in this final week. Now, if we take a look at the Pittsburgh Steelers, there's Still trying to figure things out at the quarterback position. The one thing that you like to bet on in the preseason, if there is a quarterback competition, you are going to have an edge. Obviously, you don't have that with the Detroit Lions. Now, last week's game left a lot to be desired on who that starting quarterback is going to be for the Pittsburgh Steelers. Is it going to be veteran presence here in Russell Wilson, who looked terrible to start that game? Is it going to be Justin Fields, who we know is much more athletic at this stage in his career, but really didn't set the tone for that football team over the past two weeks when he got his chance to play in the preseason? So I can imagine Mike Tomlin actually in game number three still playing at least one of those veteran quarterbacks trying to win a job will lay the three points here with the Pittsburgh Steelers in their game number three here in the preseason against the Detroit Lions. Let's flip it over and head to the city of brotherly love. That's going to be a game also at one o'clock on Saturday. Rotation number 123-124. That is the Minnesota Vikings taking on the Philadelphia Eagles. Current lines in this game a minus two and a half point favorite for the Eagles in a total that comes in at 34 and a half. We're going to lay the points here with the Philadelphia the Eagles. The one thing that we do know is I don't think any starters are going to play for the Eagles, but there's an outside chance that maybe some of those guys could get snaps. Why? They haven't taken any snaps in the first two games, but that's not really what we're looking for. It's not if Jalen Hurts is going to play. The factor is Tanner McKean has been a very good backup quarterback here in the preseason. He's probably going to get the majority of the snaps in this game and has showed himself very well in that Baltimore game and also New England game. So if I'm getting the better backup quarterback position here, I do think the Philadelphia Eagles come away with a victory over the Minnesota Vikings. So we'll lay the two and a half points with the Eagles. So two favorites on Saturday at one o'clock. We'll take the Pittsburgh Steelers on the road laying three points. Then we'll take the Philadelphia Eagles at home laying two and a half points. Let's get it started. We are so close to regular season football. We can taste it. Let's get a 2-0 and advantage here on Saturday. I'm Donnie Wrightside for Bookmakers Review. And as always, good luck on those wagers. 